Hi everyone, this is Katerina Christakos, and today I'm going to show you three fun ways of making videos without actually having to be on the camera. So, this is the tool I use, and underneath this video is the link to it. Um, what I do is I go to Create Video, and I can do 3D avatars, kinetic, or whiteboard. So let me show you 3D avatars. Click here, click Next and they have a bunch of pre-done templates in here, eight pages worth. Now, you could have a man or a woman. Let's go with a woman. And these templates right here are for, let's say, local video. So if you're doing something for a local client, um, you can click here. Let's say we're gonna use this one. Next step. Um, this is what she looks like. If you wanted to change to a different uh, person. You could do Emily or any of these. Now, this is the cool, cool part of this. You click Next, and they have ready-made voiceovers that go with this, and you can hear it. If you're looking for a quality bakery for your next event, you probably have a lot of questions, such as... Yeah, that comes with this. So, there's something else you can do here. If you didn't like what they had written, you can paste in here any text you want and then click auto translate and import speech and that avatar would say whatever you want um, in the video. Now, here's another cool thing. You can have it in English or you can, um, let's say, do British, auto translate, import speech, and then play. If you're looking for a quality bakery for your next event, you... Pretty cool, right? And they've got a ton of different languages here. Everything from Australian English to Welsh English, and you've got U.S. Spanish, Turkish, Swedish, pr almost any language you want is in here. And they have it already done for you. If you wanted your own voice, you click record audio, and again. If you wanted background music, you can click here, and look at their media library and uh, find something that you want to put as background music. Or you could upload your own. Then you click Next Step and you put a logo in there. Um, you t tell it which position you want the logo in. Background is in the media library. We've got bakery, but there's a bunch of other backgrounds. You could put in the name of company and oh, pretty much anything you want here. So uh, let's take a look at what this is going to look like. And here we go. If you're looking for a quality bakery for your next event, you probably have a lot of questions, such as, do you create baked goods for the type of event I am having? Are you available for the date of my event? Now, this is the content. You can move things around in here. I'm not going to do that right now. I think you get the point of how to do this type of video. Now we're going to go back and try a different one. And again, if you want to try this out, the link to this software is underneath this video. So, let's go back home and let's see the second way to make video. Kinetic animation. Next step. And again, there's templates in here. Um, female, male, female, and Let's say this one, click next. Searching for business services? Then contact our efficient and ex- Again, same process. Text to speech if you want to. Let's try Brazilian Portuguese this time. Auto translate, import speech, play audio. Procurando serviços empresariais? Em seguida completely done for you. Next step, same thing. Here's what it's going to look like. Procurando serviços empresariais? Em seguida, entre em contato com nossa equipe eficiente e experiente. Pretty cool, right? Okay, I'll show you the third way. <laughs> Great video. Let's try a whiteboard. And, oh, as you can see here, there's a blank canvas one, too. I'll show you how to do that. So you can do everything from scratch using this tool. For now, let me show you whiteboard animations. 
Let's do this one. Next step. Are you looking for a local reliable and affordable air conditioning installation? Do you need a... Again, you have the same uh, options here. You can do music if you want to. Please, uh, okay. Import speech. Next step. Again, you can put your lo a logo in here, left or right. All that is uh, easy. Let's say, uh, I don't remember what we're doing here, but let's try plumbers in Manhattan. Whatever it is. With a phone number. Next step. Give it a second. Are you looking for a local, reliable, and affordable air conditioning installation? Okay. So, again, you can add or subtract anything from here. You can add in new elements from here. You could do an intro, an outro. It's really point and click simple. And I'm going to just show you the uh, way to do it if you wanted to do it all on your own. Okay. Create video, blank canvas. Next step. You can choose male, female. Hmm, this is neat. Let me see what this is. Ah, okay. I don't have that one. All right. So we got this. I can choose whoever I want. Let's say I like Emily. Next step. I can type in whatever um, text I want here. Hi, I'm Emily. If I didn't like the way that sounded, I can go find somebody else. Let's just see if that's Sally. Hi, I am Emily. I like the way that sounds better, right? And type as much as you want in here. Again, you can translate it into whatever language you want. Add music. Next step, media library, logo. Um, background media library. So I can have Emily in any of these scenes here. So let's click here. Okay. Next step. And then click here. And I can click there. And I can move her here. Very easy. And that's, uh, that's how easy it is to do all this. All right. Uh, I hope that you enjoyed this. Uh, three easy and fun ways to make videos without having to be on camera. And um, click the link below if you'd like this software. Have a nice day. Bye.